Hi and welcome to NOBTS. I want to add my name to the list of people who've welcomed you as new students and just let you know who I am and what I do and why that matters to you today. My name is Craig Garrett and I serve as the Dean of Students and an Associate Professor of Counseling here at the seminary. And I just wanted to cover a few things with you about student affairs, student life, student services uh, that you will want to know as you start your time as an NOBTS student. A lot of what we do in my office is what we tend to call the other education, uh, the education that happens outside the classroom. And make no mistake, that's the kind of thing that can really make this time at seminary uh, something that's, that's special. You're going to learn a lot in the classroom, but outside the classroom you'll form relationships with others, you'll take part in activities that are uh, that are various according to uh, your interests and the interests of others. You'll meet people who will be your friends and partners in ministry for the rest of your life. And so let me encourage you to, to embrace that wholeheartedly. So just a few words of wisdom to you, some things that I think may be good tips. First of all, read the student handbook. You may honestly not read the whole thing because there are parts of it that won't apply to you. If you don't need to know uh, the details of how the trash is taken out in a dorm, if you don't live in the dorm, certainly that's understandable. But it's a comprehensive document that has parts that, in, that, uh, that apply to everybody. So let me commend to you especially the first 10 pages or so where you can read the, uh, the contract that the seminary has with students, our rights and responsibilities, your rights and responsibilities, and how we come together and we build a community around those things as we glorify God and serve His people. Uh, read through the student handbook. Uh, you'll read the ethical conduct code of the seminary. Uh, certainly an important thing for you to understand. You're here because you have given evidence of a call to ministry and others in your life have recommended you for this work. And so we are confident in that and confident that you're going to bring all those things to the table and be a good student and a good citizen at the seminary but it never hurts to go back and read through the ethical and personal conduct section of the handbook so that you can be sure of where we stand on some of the specific things that, uh, that you'll need to know as you walk through your time at the seminary. So we take those as a charge from Southern Baptists, from uh, those who uh, have given us this task to do, and we just ask that you abide by them and let us help you do so anytime that we can. If you have any questions about that, don't hesitate to reach out to me personally or to reach out to our office. Another thing I want you to know is that the Dean of Students Office exists for you. Uh, we can help you with any question you've got. I think you're going to hear this from a lot of people, but if you've got a question about something that's going on at the seminary and you don't know where to start, if you don't know how to find out the information, pick up the phone, send us an email, walk in the door. We have an open door policy. That includes me. If I'm not doing something that just absolutely prevents it, I'll talk to you anytime. Uh, let us know what you need. If we're not the people that can do the exact thing for you, we probably know who that person is and we'll walk you over there, make the call, make sure that you get what you need. We want you to be able to access the services of the seminary conveniently. Remember, things like the writing center, the library, the ITC, the, uh, the uh, Information Technology Center, uh, the REC, the Providence Guest House. Uh, all of these things apply to every single student. So whether you're here on the campus, where you can easily access that stuff, or if you're an online student or a distant student who may be visiting the campus, certainly it's all available to you. And if you need student services where you are, then we make every effort to provide the full breadth of student services to everyone, no matter their delivery system. Uh, read the student handbook, peruse the website. If you've got a question, definitely pick up the phone, shoot us an email, message us through social media, uh, give us a call. We want to help you out with that as well. Again, welcome to NOBTS. This is a great place to study. It's a wonderful city. Uh, you certainly can uh, train here and serve anywhere. And, uh, and so we're proud of that and just want to help you do it and to follow the calling that God has for you. Thanks and welcome.